What's up guys, Cracker Jacker 80 here, and today I'm bringing you guys a Minecraft tutorial in place of my regular Minecraft LP episodes on Fridays, and today we're going to be talking about hydrating soil, and the basics, and techniques, and all that stuff. Um, so we're going to start with the very basic thing, is that the soil has to be uh, at most four blocks away from the water source block. So here's the water source block, it, this one is two blocks away and is hydrated, this one is five blocks away, it is not hydrated. As you can see. And another thing is, the water has to be on the same level as the dirt block, or one above it, to be hydrated. Uh, so this one's in the same level, and over here is one above, it's still hydrated, this one is not, because it's five blocks away. Another thing is, if you have a 9x9 nine nine grid, and the water block is placed in the center of it, then all the blocks will be hydrated, because uh, it reaches four this way, four that way, four that way, four that way, and also diagonally, so four like that. Alright, so let's talk about some of the things um, that will make a block get dehydrated. Uh, one of the things is if a pu piston pushes it. Um, this is not a sticky piston, so right now I'll just try it with a sticky piston. Alright, I'm waiting for that to be hydrated, I'll talk about a few other things. So, if a player jumps on a dirt block, uh, like so then the dirt block will automatically become dehydrated. As well if a mo as a mob, if a mob jumps on a uh, dirt block, then it'll also be dehydrated. If an enderman uh, spawns or teleports onto a dirt block, then it'll be uh, dehydrated. And over here, uh, as you can see, the piston actually, I don't think it really affects it that much. Um, but if this is on it, then uh, obviously the seed will be will disappear from it and uh, it'll not work. Um, so yeah, that's basically all there is to it. Um, so just it's pretty simple. Uh, a nine by nine grid, four blocks on each side and four blocks on the diagonal will hydrate all of this. So you plant wheat on it and uh, you decide to if you want to harvest it. Then it'll easily grow. Yay. <laughs> so, yeah, and, um, so thanks for watching, guys. Uh, this has been a tutorial on how to hydrate soil and all the basics to it. Uh, we'll make them dehydrate and all that stuff. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial, and peace.